Hey guys, check it out. You're looking at my HP Pavilion Desktop 550 150. Um, this HP desktop is my new streaming machine. And today I'm going to upgrade it with a wireless AC card. So I just bought this the other day, but it only comes with wireless uh, G and N inside of it. Uh, in fact, you can see it there. Integrated Bluetooth 4 and wireless LAN BGN. So it's a little bit uh, underrated for what I need. I need that extra grunt so that I can uh, stream more effectively. I've just upgraded my entire network to be able to help me do that. So it's kind of a waste to not have this machine do this. So I was just about to open this screw, but I can see that it actually requires a bigger flathead than what I've got just here. So uh, let me grab this guy. So this is my first time opening up this machine. It's a an Intel i5 machine. It's been a while since I've looked inside of a PC, but yeah, that's usually how you open it. So for those of you who've never looked inside of a PC before, you can tell that the CPU is under here. We've got the RAM card. We've got one SODIMM RAM there. It's pretty difficult to see it from where it is. This is the hard drive here. Uh, there's a shiny silver disc thing that goes in that thing. It's neat that it's got one of those ejectable coaster drives. That's, you know, it spits out a shiny silver coaster for you to, I have no idea why anybody uses those anymore. Okay, I can see right there, that's gonna be the wireless card. I don't know if you can quite see that. I'm just gonna zoom in a little bit for you. Yeah, so, so that thing there is the little wireless card. So it's not removable, which means I'm just gonna have to means I'm just gonna have to put my other wireless card right above it. So I've just taken uh, this uh, side plate off and one of the one of the uh, metal connectors off. I'm just gonna get inside the the box of the TP link here. So there's the inside of that box. It's also got a mini in case. Observe precautions handling sensitive devices. So basically what I want to do is uh, use an anti-static uh, mat or uh, make sure that I'm well grounded before inserting this. So there's the card itself. See it's got quite a bit of cooling on it and around it. So now I can screw this plate back together. That goes like that. Now why, you might ask, would I leave both cards in? It's so that I can still connect to the internet while I'm trying to install this new card. That's in. All that's left to do Install these two antennas at the back here. There we go, all done. Well, I'm going to uh, close this back up and start setting up my wireless LAN. Thanks very much for watching. As you can see, it's pretty darn easy to uh, set one up, just making sure this case is, is flush when you put it back together. Uh, don't forget, you can subscribe, like, and share. Please tune into any of my live streams. Of course, I'll be live streaming using this exact machine right here. Uh, if you have any questions, post them in the comment section below. Of course, you can find the links to the uh, wireless end card and, of course, to this desktop uh, on Amazon in the About section below as well. If you found this video particularly useful, you can, of course, buy me a cup of coffee as well. Thanks very much for watching. Hope you check out my other videos. Talk soon.